Meghan Markle, 40, has split opinions since she married Prince Harry in 2018, with some criticism happening when the couple stepped back as senior members. Catherine Ryan, 38, has spoken exclusively to Express. Co.uk about her opinion on Meghan and how she has been left baffled why others are so aggravated by the former royal. Catherine takes a lot of time to make sure feminism is a large part of her career as a comedian and opportunities are given to others in her field. She has previously praised Meghan for being so open about her miscarriage during the Oprah Winfrey interview, having suffered from one herself the year before. Express.co.uk asked Catherine why she thinks Meghan is so heavily criticized and whether it had anything to do with her position as a woman. Catherine said, I think when you join into such an infamous family, then you're under the microscope. I believe that anyone, certainly any woman who deviates from what is expected of them is going to face criticism. So I certainly think that I love Meghan Markle's voice and her confidence to challenge the norm and what's expected of her in that role. But equally any time that you challenge an idea people are going to come after you. Catherine then debated why Meghan is such a target for many and whether her confidence could be to blame. She continued, so, I mean I'm not exactly sure what makes her such a target, but I think it's her confidence in challenging the shape of what a woman in that role should like, which is someone who wears stockings. Someone who covers their shoulders, someone who follows the rules. I feel like I would find it very challenging being real because many of us couldn't fit into those constraints very easily. It would feel like a real infringement on your sense of personal freedom. Not so, I don't understand why people feel so aggravated by that, I think it's a great challenge and things evolve. Catherine is currently recovering from COVID after contracting the virus in lockdown and has partnered with Gusto to help regain her taste and smell. Catherine said, My husband noticed first that we couldn't smell and I thought he was wrong. I ran around collecting different things in the house to prove him wrong, but I couldn't smell anything. I hadn't realized because I could still taste but on reflection, the whole flavor experience when losing smell is really different. Catherine then talked about the impact Gusto has had on her and her family, especially in lockdown. She said, I mean, it has had such an impact on my family's mealtime and cooking and really enhanced our flavors. I know a lot of people feel quite sad and powerless about losing their smell and taste. And that's not what you know as a comedian. I always want to bring joy and variety to people's lives, 